It's a nice sunny day. First nice day. Probably waiting for my son to pick me up. Dropped the car off to get a new windshield or get inspected. It needs a new airbag because it's a Honda airbag recall. But it's April. It was nice the beginning of March. And then it has been shitty since. It's breezy. I don't know if the wind will make noise on the GoPro or not. All right, I'm gonna turn you off. I don't have anything to say. Hello folks, we're uh, home on Sunday. Um, we got caught by good weather, which means we're home in a weekend we don't wanna be home. We should be, uh, we should be out camping, but because uh, it wasn't that great Friday and we have an awful lot of work to do. Uh, we're gonna have to stay home and work on the house, which really the house needs a lot of work. Uh, we haven't cleaned up the yard in a while. I, I uh, found a guy to mow the lawn for me so I can camp. And uh, there's a lot of stuff in the yard <laughs> from the dogs that uh, we need to clean up. Had a bunny rabbit in the yard this morning. Made Caesar a little crazy. He's uh he's out here trying to find it now. But uh, we're gonna clean up the yard. We have to vacuum the house. There is a lot of work to be done to get it ready for camping and I really want to go camping next week. The bungees aren't connected. The weather stripping hasn't been finished. Oh well, I think I'll just do the weather stripping and leave it at that. Once the weather stripping's on and we'll rehook the bungees. The bungees look like they're brand new, which is frustrating. <laughs> It's an eight-year-old camper. They should not look brand new. <laughs> so I'm not going to change those out. And uh, they were just screwed down under a cap with some sealer on it. So I'll redo that. Hey, folks. I'm about to reattach the bungees. Um, I had originally hoped that there was a sweet spot where the bungees would come to where they're anchored. Um, when the roof was like halfway up or down, but apparently that doesn't happen. Um, as you can see, I've got the bungees just hanging up there, and uh, I have to yank them to pull them down. Let me show you. They have to come way down to here, and that's under tension. So I got to pull those to get slack in them. So I can anchor them. So it's not going to be easy. Um, I'm going to I'm going to stick them down, and it, it so there's just a cap, a little cap like this, and two screws that uh, go into the cap. They're fairly long screws. I'm surprised how long they are. But um, two screws in the Ideal thing is for the bungee to go around the screws, or between them maybe, and um, have it completely sealed with silicone sealer, which is what I am using to kind of seal it and glue them in there, uh, protect them from wear and stuff. But uh, it's going to be interesting. So let's see how that goes. Well, the boys knocked over the camera, so we lost the video. But I just wanted to show you I had to clamp the uh two by four and hold the um to hold the bungees so they were slack where they went into the clamp and uh this worked out real well a little piece of board to keep from damaging the bungees or the roof and uh, i put them in between the screws and screwed them down and just before i tightened up the screws i injected it with a lot of silicone and it all squeezed out the sides and the back and everything and 
cleaned it up a little bit and that worked absolutely great. So I think these are in the same shape they were when I got them and I think they're going to be super. Waiting for my son to pick me up. Drone go! Waiting for my son to pick me up.